Yamal Nadal, she's going to throw out the double. She's having a practice start of the doubles to set up the doubles. Game shot on the second leg. Well, McConnell says OK. 100%. She might, could we say 125% yeah, on exactly. the doubles? Good old real car, 110. 110 options for Suzuki. Excellent start. Excellent dart. And double 16 would make it an excellent finish. Game Fabulous shot, shot from Akira Suzuki, Suzuki just when Kevin Painter looked like stretching his lead to 3 0. Missed start to do so. We'll start on treble 19. And we'll now move to treble 18. And finds it for a go at the bullseye. Oh, Game wow. From Akira Suzuki, Suzuki has been struggling through this match, struggling through this day so far. But in that leg, a 1 8 and a 1 2 Game 3 on. check out. You mentioned about Kevin Painter liking to, if he saw a bit of fluff on the stage, he'd throw it off. Joe Cullen throws off an imaginary bit of fluff when he gets on the stage. That's his little superstition. One of the days! Ruki Muramatsu just hits 180s. Probably a better way to ensure you win darts matches. It's a more sustainable approach, isn't it? You can't always rely 16. on a bit of fluff Ruki on the floor Ruki or green light changing for you. And he finds the green Game bit. shot on the fourth leg, Haruki Muramatsu. On a Monday afternoon. And Game it will be, shot on because Haruki Muramatsu has sealed a 4-1 success against his fellow Japanese star. It hasn't been Makuru Suzuki's day at all here on Monday, and she's going to need a miracle if she is going to climb to the top of this group. A different day tomorrow, disappointing one for her today. It's Haruki Muramatsu who wins by a 4-1 margin. There's one game left to play. Kevin Painter takes on the so far undefeated Andreas Harrison. Things are give you here for... Muramatsu, we've seen him miss doubles, we've seen him miss the big numbers, but luckily this is two big numbers next to each other. 48, Makuro Yukar, 32. Darts now that Muramatsu has missed on the outer ring. Game shot on the third Suzuki, leg, Makuro Suzuki. strength for her is her finishing. A double in this game, so surely if he gets one here, he's more likely to miss than hit. Won't even get one, we won't find out. Makuro Suzuki... 56. Three darts to win Makuru for the first Kaur, time. 36. Game shot on the and match. Win. Mikuru she Suzuki. does. Suzuki off the mark here at the Moda Super Series. Having lost all of the five fixtures yesterday, Makuru Suzuki is off to a winning start on Tuesday. And Aruki Muramatsu is left to rue. 11 missed starts at double, seven of them coming in the opening leg. So Painter will have the chance here to just restore that two-leg cushion from earlier in the match. Of all the places, of all the places Kevin Painter could have gone. 70. Makuru Rukar, 20. Left himself 99, which of course can't be completed in two darts. Game shot on the fourth leg. Mikuru Suzuki makes pain to pay. Last time he was punished by Mikuru Suzuki. And he's Game punished shot again. on the third leg. Mikuru A Suzuki. Super check out by Suzuki. Need two more trebles, but going for the 20 if you hit the single. You can't leave the finish. May have been a moot point anyway. Suzuki looking at double eight. Game shot on the second leg. Makuro Suzuki. Not a super series from Suzuki. Oh, must be severely blocked. Look at that. Game shot How on the third leg. Found a way in Suzuki. There. What a shot from Makuro Suzuki. It's just a double eight, but it is the most incredible dart you may see today. You 71. Know what, Phil? Makuro Kart 120. Mystic Murphy's is back. That's the first part. That's the second. Inevitable. Game shot on the fourth leg. Oh. Mikuru Suzuki. Mystic Murph strikes again, as does Mikuru Suzuki. 
for Makuru Suzuki, having already taken out 120. Gets two darts to seal the deal. Still on, double seven. Still on, double seven. And Game Makuru shot Suzuki, on, the match. Makuru Suzuki. on double seven, makes it a double at the start of today's play. Two from two for Makuru. Rebel 20 to start. This is exactly how she did it 24 hours ago. Single 20. And then tops. Game shot on the second leg. Nothing Mikuru sweeter Suzuki. than a repeater for Makuru Suzuki. Rebel 20. For the double. Game shot on the third Suzuki. leg. Makuru Suzuki. Takes the throw. End her week with a win. Double 12 will do it. Game that shot of the match. Mikuru Suzuki. Suzuki. In her final match of a week here at the Moda Super Series. A decent enough display, a 4 2 success. Nerves on debut. Although Muramatsu on debut, we have seen him on stage as many times before. There's not that little bit more Game experience in front of the cameras. And he's putting that all too good work here. Well, in Game the end, on the Muramatsu match. gets Muramatsu. there. Just nettled it in off that barrel on double 10. And Decker is beaten in the opener. A 4-1 success for that man, Muramatsu. Decent enough display as well, having lost the first leg. He won four on the spin. Ruhio Car 38. Options here. Deciding against splitting it. Game and hitting shot it. In the match. And Muramatsu. he's turned it around against Kevin Painter, who will surely be beside himself, having missed a dart to win that match 4-1. He's ended up losing it 4-3, and the artist disappears into the distance. Muramatsu's had a good day. He's hit some big stuff, but he's yet to hit a finish over 100. 86. Chris Yukar, 146. The wait will continue. He could yet find himself behind. Treble 19 is the target. Whoops, another one. It was difficult. It was sitting quite high in that treble. That's not ideal 94. for him. 94. Car 20. I suppose he could have looked at an alternative route. It would have been an orthodox. Game shot on the third mm. leg. A In the end, Muramatsu. Muramatsu takes a leg and leads 2-1. Double two is a nice double for Chris. But now he's got what is probably the worst double on the board for him. That doesn't look like it's covering too much of the two. leg because it's over to the Rookie right, but he can't five. find it. So Muramatsu looking... To pick up the pieces. Five in bits. One for double two. It's infectious. Kevin Painter started it. Chris Wickerden followed. And now, well, Matsu with the step back. And now he ends up on double one. Game he shot the four flag. And that Haruki is no doubt the key moment so far in this contest. As well, also leaves Harrison on an awkward kind of number to try and leave a finish. Needs to find a treble 19. Now it should go at the bull. 101. Has managed Haruki to Kafe leave a finish, but it's the biggest of the lot. And if Muramatsu hits this, it's game over. Game shot on the match. Fantastic Haruki result. For Haruki Muramatsu, a 4-2 success over the league leader. An average just under 95 from Muramatsu, who really turned up in that game and inflicted just a second defeat. Taking it well, well, that's one way of uh, rubbing it in from Haruki Muramatsu. A little beard tickle. I wonder if he's a couple more visits away from actually having a word with the referee or with Haruki himself. He won't like this if it goes Being in. It does go in. Leg, it's 3-0 to Muramatsu. Double nine.
for a 4 0 win. Game and it is shot sealed. Of the match. Well, it's a 4 0 victory, but it was surely something that upset Kevin Painter in that match. A respectful handshake in the end. Then we do have a slight conversation with the referee, Paul Hinks. Not sure what that was all about, but Painter did shake hands, as he should as a sportsman. Haruki Muramatsu, though, got the points in that game. Four legs on the spin. Andres Harrison faces Makiru Suzuki in game two. In leg two, Muramatsu is looking for a blockbuster. And he Danger gets one. Second leg. A magnificent Muramatsu. Muramatsu moment. A superb finish. Go on, course, straight for the ball. He's not tempted. He's sensible. He's still got a lot to play for here. Double nine, not found. 32. And the writing may well be Haruki on the wall. 52. Because Haruki Muramatsu has not missed a single dart at double in this game. And he's got two. And Game he only needs one. And it's a flawless display of finishing from Haruki Muramatsu, who has finished this day very, very well indeed. Fabulous stuff from him. He lost his first match, but he's won his last four. And in doing so, has put himself in contention. At the top of the table, Muramatsu defeats Kordeka 4-1. There you see how good the performance was. An average of over 100. 100% on the doubles. Matsu has the break opportunity on 74. It's going to be the solitary dart at tops. In fact, it's going to be double 10 because he's found the tops. Game shot on the double, first double. leg. Double, double, why not, Matsu. Haruki? Anyukar, 78. Oh, that's unlucky. And I think that was actually in the 54. 38. Haruki Ukar, 74. And there we go. The dart of disappointment. Are these going to be the darts of elation for Muramatsu? 74 for the match. He's going to get two in hand. A double 16 to complete a comprehensive victory against Ryan Palmer by four legs to nil. In looking for another one of those, which he finds. So double six. Game shot on the second leg. A masterful finishing there from Haruki Muramatsu. Haruki Okar, 96. So, 96 for Muramatsu. Double 18 for Muramatsu. Game shot on the second So, level this game Haruki up at one apiece. Superb 96 finish to square the affair up. Game shot on the match. And the match Muramatsu. won by Muramatsu by four legs to one. He gets the better of Mike Gillett. So, this could be the most significant moment of the night so far. Double top for Haruki Muramatsu. Game shot on the and that leg. is the leg Haruki that Muramatsu. confirms Andreas Harrison's place in the semi-finals. The Swede is through. McGurk would have the darts in the decider, but boy, he'd be under pressure. Game shot on the sixth and leg. he's under pressure. Haruki Muramatsu. Going to get two darts at tops, but is that a blocker? He's not moved. Now one more at tens. Game shot on the third there leg. There it is. Haruki Muramatsu. Haruki Muramatsu leads in this game.